Tanya Snyder's video during the halftime between the Green Bay Packers and the Washington Commanders yesterday was greeted with a boos and chants of sell the team. Yesterday, during the 90th year ceremony of the Washington Football Organization, uh, Tanya Snyder greeted the fans with a video and, of course, courses of boos throughout the stadium and certainly also I don't, I don't know if, if the 60 percent of those there who are green bay packers fans joined in on the booze or not but certainly the fans there who are not happy with the organization's leadership especially the ownership all joined in with courses of sell the team now yesterday a lot of fans who were there present who were holding up signs of Dan sell the team had their signs confiscated by security. Security told them to either hand over the signs or not to display the signs. And there were even those who brought the trash bags, you know, the, the, uh, the paper trash bags that you cut out holes for your eyes and your mouth and all that. And you put over your, your head and usually those trash bags are going to say, you know, Dan sell the team. Even they could not wear those. Uh, there were some fans who had T-shirts made with the message on the T-shirts saying, Dan sell the team. Now, I don't know if that they were forced to take their shirts off or not. And I think that's a little bit of an extreme thing. But certainly the, the ownership is hearing... They are definitely hearing it from the fans loud and clear. And the fans are giving them the message loud and clear. And, you know, I will say this teeter-totters between uh, the, the right to the freedom of speech. Now, I guess you can look at this two ways about it, you know. Um, this is private property, and this is certainly a place where the ownership can decide what what goes on and what doesn't go on. And so they probably have just as much right to confiscate signs that they disagree with um, as much as fans have the right to voice their opinions. I mean, they're not really voicing anything that is vulgar or anything like that. Um, so, you know, that kind of shows you the mentality of Dan Snyder, right? Um, you know, he can't, can't take the criticism. Well, you know, if you don't want to be criticized, then don't do things to be criticized about. That's pretty much my motto with anything you got. So, you know, the fans are going to be vocal about this until the team is sold. And again, this is just this is just something more that the media is going to run with. And any chance they get to voice their displeasure over Dan Snyder, it's going to happen. And I mean, me honestly, I'm not. I'm not upset that upset with that one bit, um, and I don't think a lot of uh, Washington fans are upset with that either. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Um, if you like this video, then like it, leave a comment, share it with your friends, uh, subscribe to this channel if you possibly can, and I will guess what. I'm going to see you in the next one. Hey, you stayed until the very end. Thank you so much. Watch another one right now.